Baroness Margaret Thatcher, former Prime Minister of the UK for 11 years, has died. She led the Conservative Party to three general election victories and changed the face of British politics. With me to discuss how the so-called Iron Lady transformed Britain is editor of the Financial Times, Lionel Barber. Lionel, what was her political legacy? For someone of my generation who remembers growing up with Margaret Thatcher, I was a journalist in Scotland at the time, it's really hard to imagine life without her, political life. She redefined the role of the state, rolling back the frontiers of the state. She privatized great industries, uh, introduced a spirit of entrepreneurialism. Yes, there was a cost, uh, at times high unemployment, but she really did change the country and the way it was governed. Um, and you mentioned some of her economic legacy there. Um, do you think any of that has changed since the financial crisis, the way that we look back on that? You have to see Margaret Thatcher as part of a wider movement in the West. She led it along with Ronald Reagan, which was to liberalize, to, to free entrepreneurial power, to reduce the role of the state. Deregulation was, was uh, the buzzword at the time. And of course, 35 years on or so, we've seen the cost of that with the financial crisis. But I think for at least 30 years, she led a new and very influential movement throughout the West. She was quite a performer on the world stage. What else was her sort of global influence? Well, I think the most important was she, she stood shoulder to shoulder, as she used to say, with Ronald Reagan in confronting Soviet power. And in that respect, along with other influences, particularly the European Union, which was very successful in, in promoting uh, well, greater prosperity in Western Europe. That was a magnet for change in Eastern Europe. But she, she did contribute in her own way through ideology to the unraveling of communism. And how do you think historians are going to look back on the, the reign of Margaret Thatcher in 20, 30, 40, even 100 years time? Whatever the political viewpoint, and it's interesting watching and listening to some of the commentary uh, about Margaret Thatcher, left and right respected her as a leader. Uh, she will have been seen to have arrested British decline in the late 1970s, to have restored a sense of pride. She took risks, remember, with uh, confronting the Argentines over the invasion of the Falklands. And overall, she was a very successful politician, the first woman prime minister, winning, as you say, three successive elections. She, of course, was deposed by the Conservative Party, they'd almost, people had got fed up with her, but her legacy remains. It's a very positive legacy for the Conservative Party and for the country. Lionel, thank you very much. Plenty more, of course, on this story uh, on ft.com forward slash UK.